Hello, I'm Chris and I'm the editor of Mac Format Magazine. I'm very fond of this, which is the Logitech Ultra Thin Keyboard for the iPad. Uh, it's a very slim, clean, light thing. I used to use it a lot when I had a full-size iPad, but now I have an iPad Mini. And luckily Logitech has just released, we've just got this in. This is the UK version of the Logitech Ultra Thin Keyboard for the iPad Mini. It works on the same basic idea. Take your iPad, it attaches magnetically using the same system of magnets that the smart cover uses. And that's it. You have a little laptop to take with you, so you've got all your iPad, uh, but with a good keyboard attached to it. And un clip it, drop it in there, and you're good to go. In fact, this is held in magnetically, so that even if you're on a train that's jouncing along, this isn't your iPad isn't going to jump out of, the, uh, out of the case. Now, in order to get it quite small, Logitech's had to be quite clever. Now, if we show you up close, you'll see that the keyboard layout has actually changed quite a lot. We don't actually have shift keys and other keys in the left-hand side here. We've got a shift key there, and the A has been repurposed as a caps lock key you hold down with function and then tapping that. Now, some other little tricks as well. Now, the effect of all this is that it does take a little bit of remapping your muscle memory to use this well. But with the constraints of um, the, the device, with the fact that it's a small iPad and you have to fit in a full width keyboard into that, it actually works remarkably well. Uh, it's available in black and white, it's available now. It does cost £70, and the big one costs 90 and th th so these are not cheap things. We'll be doing a full review soon, but first impressions are really quite favourable. It feels fantastic to type on some clever stuff to make the keyboard as big as it can be within the width of the iPad Mini, uh, and I think I'm going to be doing a lot of writing on this in the weeks and months ahead.